YouTube. I am going to show you in this video what I got from BH Cosmetics and how to do this look with the neutral palette. So you're going to have to excuse me because this is the first time I'm filming on my camera. So the focus might be a little bit off. Another thing is I filmed this tutorial one time and it completely got erased so I had to do it again. That's why I'm wearing different outfits now and then when I show you what I got from BH Cosmetics. Let's get into the haul and tutorial. Okay, so I'm going to show you what I got from B&H, or BH Cosmetics, not B&H, BH Cosmetics. The first thing that I'm going to show you is I got the stippling brush, which I'm really excited for because I've never had one. Um, I'm going to be putting my foundation on with this. I love It's so soft and I love it. It's very soft and I can't wait to to use that because I usually just use my hands but we'll see if this is better the next things that I got is the 28 color palette smoky eye edition these colors are absolutely beautiful I don't really do too many smoky eyes but if I'm going out at night or something is usually when I wear um, more of an intense eye look. Otherwise, I just do like neutral looks. So this is the 28 color palette, the Smoky Eye. I'm sure you have all seen this already, but me getting back into YouTube videos, um, I saw a lot of people talk about this one and uh, I heard really good things about it, so I'm super excited to use these colors. And I'll put the link down for the VH Cosmetics website and how much each of these are because I can't remember how much they are right now. So the next one I got is the neutral palette because like I said, in during the daytime and like going to school and stuff, I usually just wear neutral colors and that's um, the look that I'm going to be showing you today. So this one, a shinier packaging is kind of weird. Uh, I like the matte ones better. I don't know why. I just feel like they feel more professional. Oh, doo -doo -doo. How do I get this open? I have no fingernails right now because I keep biting them. Okay. One of these is broken and it just fell in my lap. And it would be the darkest color, black. I have to see if I can fix this. Oh my god, I am making a huge mess. Okay, so this is a neutral palette. See all the beautiful colors. I was really excited about this one because it has a lot of matte colors and I love matte colors. I'm not too much on the shimmer. I like matte colors way better. So I'm really excited to try this out. The last palette that I purchased is broken and I'm really sad because it was the one that I was most excited for and that was the six color palette um, the blush and the contour and the highlighting uh, one well, I'm not gonna show you that one because it is one of them so is completely broken there was pink blush everywhere I got it all over my hands got it everywhere it was so mad. so I think I can send that back I was reading and I think you can send those back and they give you another one so hopefully they will okay so I'm starting off with my Urban Decay shadow primer potion I'm putting that all over my lid and up to my eyebrow next I'm taking my MAC 239 brush and applying the white eyeshadow to my eye. It's like a tan white color. I'm going to take my same brush and put it in this pretty purple color and put it on my lid. I like using this purple color because it brings out the green in my eyes. 
Next, I'm going to take my MAC 217 brush and put it in this pretty copper color, all in the crease of my eye. I like using the brown colors that have red undertones in them because it also brings out the green in my eyes. Next, I'm going to take this big fluffy brush and put it back in that light color that we started off with to blend out the harsh edges of the copper color. I like doing this because I just don't like very harsh looks for the daytime and this is just a neutral daytime look. Next I'm going to take my 239 brush and put it in that copper color and put it underneath my eyelid. Next I'm going to curl my eyelashes and then I'm going to apply my Laura Mercier full blown volume mascara in black. Now for my eyebrows, I'm going to use my Maybelline Ultra Brow in light brown. Excuse my crazy eyebrows. And that concludes the look of my neutral eye. Next I'm going to do my contouring with NARS Laguna. To blend out the harsh lines, I'm using my e.l.f. Kabuki brush. For blush, I'm using my NYX Blush in Peach. And that concludes my look! Thanks for watching guys and stay tuned for some bloopers! How do I say this? I don't know. That's it. Let's get into the Holland Vittorio. Vittorio? 